Hello, this is How To Bob, and I just got this new Chicago Electric chainsaw sharpener from Harbor Freight, and I'm going to show you what's inside the box and show you how I set it up. So let's take a look and see what's inside the box. So on top, we'll see here that we have the actual grinder itself and cable and the power cord, and here's the directions inside a box here won't be needing that and then you have an adjustable vise that is screwed into a piece of cardboard so we'll go ahead and take that off now when you set this up the directions say to mount it to a vise I've decided to use a one by that I have in my shop and I'm going to mount it to that you can see there's little ledges and those go on the edge so I leave a little hangover and what I'm going to do is just take a couple of screws and washers and put those into the holes and screw this to the one by I like to have portability if I do it this way I can use a vise and clamp it to any workbench take it with me wherever I go so I'm gonna go ahead and mount it to this one by it doesn't take much there's not much pressure or force gonna be put on the grinder sharpener so I'm gonna go ahead and just use the one by and put a screw in each side like I said, it doesn't take much to hold this thing down because there's not going to be much pressure or force put on the machine itself. So once I get that second screw tightened down, I can go ahead and mount my chain vise. You can see there's a screw here. It goes in the hole and they're marked with different degrees for different cuts. So then I put my screw on the bottom. And kind of tightened up doesn't have to be real tight so it can adjust and we'll do that later and then last but not least I want to put my cable in for my uh, vise here and you may put the washer on one side or the other depending on how tight you want the vise to clamp once I get the cable in I can put my adjustable nut on and that's about all there is to setting up the Chicago electric chainsaw sharpener I'm how to Bob Thanks for watching.